Back in July of last year, I showed you all a new photo editing application from Samsung called Galaxy Enhance X. This application is Samsung's newest app that leverages AI in an attempt to improve the quality of your photos. It offers features including shadow removal, reflection removal, image upscaling, more pattern removal, and offers a way to restore some very old images. Not only that, but it also has options like an HDR tool, a way to reduce blur, lens distortion correction, and an auto fix button that will analyze the image and make improvements where it deems fit. At the time of release, the Samsung Galaxy Enhance X application was only available for the Galaxy S23 series since it was in testing phase. Since then, it has been released in beta, but it was still restricted to those devices. That has changed this month as Samsung has now made this image editing application available for the entire Galaxy S20 series, Galaxy S21 series, Galaxy S22 series, the Galaxy Note 20 series, all of the Galaxy Z flip phones, and the Galaxy Z Fold 2 and newer. So if you have any of Samsung's more recent high-end smartphones, then you can now install the Enhance X application on your device right now. This application can be found in Samsung's own Galaxy Store by simply searching for Enhance X. But I will also include a direct link to this app page in the video description below. Once the app has been installed, we can open it up and then go through a setup and onboarding process. We just have to swipe through these images here or tap skip. It's going to ask for this app to have access to your files. And then it will ask for that permission. With all of that done, it will then ask you for a photo to edit. And the type of results that you get will vary from image to image since the app uses AI to make its adjustments. But there are some times when it works really well. You can go through and select specific features and edits that you want to make, such as an HDR. You can brighten up the image. You can fix some blur and a sharpen tool. There's also a more option here, which will use AI to detect which features it believes can be used here. So you see there are a couple of options that are highlighted. So we can attempt to remove a reflection or remove shadows. But if the app doesn't find anything that it can do, then those options will be grayed out. Since there are no faces here, you can't select that option. Same thing with portrait. Same thing with a lens distortion fix and the ability to fix the more pattern or you can tap this magic icon right here and let the app detect which type of enhancements that it can do on your image. So even with the quick photo that I took right here, you can see the before version has the color of that curtain, very, very dark, but the after part of that image shows it much brighter and in much better detail. 
Samsung has come out and said that they do plan on bringing this application to its low-end and mid-range smartphones and tablets, but other than saying later this year, they have yet to confirm when we can expect this release to happen. So if you have one of their Galaxy Tab tablets or a smartphone in the Galaxy A or Galaxy M series, then look out for an announcement of this release in the coming months. And if you've had a chance to try out the Samsung Galaxy Enhance X application, then let us know what you think about it down in the comments section below. In my experience, the results are hit or miss, but when it hits, the improvements are quite impressive.